Hello. Hi. Hi. I'm, so, I'm still crying from hers. Oh, it's fine. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. This is a safe zone. You can be as emotional as you want to. What do you want to ask me about, Mama? I wanted to know if there was any messages from my Thea or my son's father. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, first of all, there's three females. Do you, is your mom's mom also past your grandma? No, she's still alive. Okay. There's a female on your mom's mom's side. There's a, there's a female on your mom's side that is above her that's a mother figure. So it's either an aunt. Is that the Thea that you're asking about? That's your mom's sister? Um, yes. Okay. So there's another female above her who is also there as well. So this would either be your grandmother's sister or yeah. because she's not okay. There's also another female as well, but this is a young female that may have passed suddenly or unexpectedly that you may have known in school. Do you remember a girl who passed in school who passed from an automobile accident? Not that I can recall right now. She showed me cheerleading and pom pom. So she either would have been a dancer or a cheerleader, or she would have been part of that crowd. But she would have had kind of like a bad. Ugh. She it would have been a bit of a gruesome passing because she makes me feel like there was a lot of damage to her face and they couldn't even have a casket open because it was so bad because she's acknowledging something like that. Um, I almost feel, thank you, she showed me Christy or Crystal. So there might be a Chris or Crystal name connects to her or connects to that crowd because she's showing me that. So there's a female there. So when you figure that out to know that that person's also. I want to um, acknowledge, I'm not really sure about the classmate. That's okay. So just FYI, so I'll leave that with you because you may need to look into that, okay? Um, so your tia, your mom's mom's. First of all, she's laughing because she says, y'all crack her up. She says she's always stopping by and she just watches y'all and y'all crack her up. Um, was one of y'all just making a joke about like the smell of a belly button or like the, the belly button smell? She's making a joke about someone joking about this not that long ago. Um, I, t I joke about it with my kids. Like I, I like tell them that their belly button stinks. Okay, because she's like making a joke about y'all talking or seeing y'all talking about the belly button smell. So there's a reference there. Cause she's acknowledging that and thank you she's laughing she's okay thank you she also um, she's showing jelly bean or jelly jelly is there a nickname jelly jelly or jelly bean or jelly because she's showing me like a nickname jelly okay. jilly or jelly or Ju jolly 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 it's almost like a name and then nickname it's a short nickname that's referencing jolene oh it could be it. It could be Yoli or Yoli, if they call her Yoli. Who is that? Jolene is the, um, that song uh, by Dolly Parton. We would always sing it. But oh. not, yeah, not of a nickname. Would you sing that with her? Yeah, we would sing it at like our family reunions all the oh, time. Oh, got it. Perfect. She might just be, got it, because I was like, Jelly be Jolie. Okay. I get it now. So she's referencing that. She got, she's repeating it. Does someone also name their bear or name something after that song? There's a reference there. Yeah, because it's almost like I feel like I want to name something Jolene as well. Because she's referencing, she, she said yes to that, but then she says there's something else about naming something or naming someone after this as well. Either that or the person's name is Dolly. But there's a reference to this as well because she's showing me that. She also, thank you, she also keeps acknowledging, do you know there's a necklace that has like a, like a heart shape or like half of a heart shape? Got it. She's acknowledging that as well, so she knows about this. She also keeps referencing, thank you. Do you have a bracelet that is also in her memory? She gave us all jewelry. Well, after she passed, she passed in Hurricane Harvey. Um, she, she, we distributed all of her jewelry. I have some necklaces and some bracelets and earrings. Got it. So she's just acknowledging the bracelet as well. Do you know if there's a bird on the bracelet or there's something about feathers on the bracelet? Um, I don't know. I'd have to look. It's okay. Just remember that I said it. Cause it almost looks like I'm seeing feathers. It could be leaves, but I'm thinking it's feathers. So there's a reference there. She also keeps acknowledging. Thank you. Is there a picture of y'all and y'all were? I don't know if y'all were like out camping or y'all were around like a bonfire and y'all. Some of y'all have hoodies and y'all are all like cold and y'all like like around it. Do you remember that picture? Family reunions. Yeah, we would have them at a farm. And uh, yeah, definitely. Perfect. So she's acknowledging that. Did y'all also like to make s'mores? Perfect. That's like some of her favorite memories because she's acknowledging that as well. Did one of you like to buy a different type of chocolate besides Hershey's? That we always buy like like the a Reese's Pieces or something and put it in instead of like the regular Hershey's because he's making a joke about the person that had to have it different. 
I'm not sure. I don't it's, remember. Okay, so you know, like we have Hershey's, but then we also have like the little, the uh, little. I would, I would always put the cream, uh, the cookies and cream. I didn't like the chocolate. Perfect. She's just acknowledging you having to have yours differently and her knowing how special you are. So she's acknowledging that. She also says, thank you. Did you see a shooting star and think of her? Yeah, I always think of uh, my, my past family members. When I see shooting stars, I think that's them just saying hi. Perfect. She's agreeing with you. And she says that is from her. That is from her. So she's acknowledging that as well. She's drawing. We're, thank you. Are you a creative or do you like to sketch or draw? No. Okay. She's showing me something that I feel like I'm sketching it or drawing it. But it almost reminds me whenever someone's drawing like an outfit out or like a dress. There's something about this that she's making reference to. Do you know? You know what? Let me backtrack on that for a second. Did someone try to make a cartoon version of someone's picture? We have that as our family too. Like we all have pictures of us as cartoon, like our heads blown up. Perfect. Like is there a picture of her like this as well? Sure, there is. Our okay. Family. Got it. She's just referring, she's acknowledging that I'm making reference to that. She says that heaven's like that. It's like a big fat cartoon. It's almost like, it's almost like craziness. So that's how she describes it. So she says it's like a big fat cartoon. It's just a lot of fun. She also, thank you. Um, did y'all all go to Disney World together? No. Okay. She's showing me Disney and Mickey Mouse. I'm trying to figure out where she's going with this. So either there's an image of her wearing like Mickey Mouse um, or there's something about a Disney ride and taking a picture on the Disney ride or at Disney because she's showing me something like that. So there's a reference to it. And so she's acknowledging that. So she's laughing. She said she did go to Disneyland. Um, it may not be like the Florida Disneyland. In Disney World, it may be like Disneyland, like California. But she's showing me something about Disneyland because he's making reference. I've seen the Carnival Cruises now. So I'm definitely thinking that she's talking about Disney. So there's a reference there because she's acknowledging that. Um, she also, thank you. Jiminy Cricket? What'd you say, Jiminy Cricket? So she's like, again, sticking with Disney. So there's something about this reference. You might need to ask your mom because she may know what she's talking about because I feel like I want to call somebody Jiminy Crickets. So there's something there that she's making a reference to. Um, she's okay. She loves you. She also, thank you. She also says, did y'all sing together and think of her when y'all were singing? Uh, when she passed away, our whole family um, gave balloons and sang. Interesting. So if y'all all sang together, she's just acknowledging that she was present when y'all all sang. So she's referencing that she was aware of that. And she says, she says, thank you. So she's acknowledging that. She's also talking about a donation. Did y'all donate in her honor or were, donate, do, were there donations in her honor? I'm not sure. I'd have to ask. Um, okay. she, she's showing me almost like a, um, a blue ribbon. And I almost feel like this has to do with like a cause or donation. So there's something there that she's trying to make reference to. Okay. She's with you, sweetheart. Is, is there any message from my son's dad? It's been six years. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. He's showing me the number 11. Do you know if November or the 11th of a month is connected? He's repeating it. So 11, 11. So he's showing me 11, 11 twice. So he's repeating the number. So there's something about a number, repeating 11, 11. So I'll leave that with you. Thank you. Do you know what time he passed? The exact time? No, but I could look it up. That's okay. I'll, I'll leave that with you. you may, if you look it up, look it up. But he's acknowledging this like double number or he's repeating 11. So there's something there. He also, it's going to sound weird. Is there a picture of him eating fried chicken or a piece of chicken? I know of. Do you know when you go to like the festivals and you have the big old turkey legs and I'm seeing like a turkey thing. So it almost reminds me of that. So I think like that. I'm pretty uh, sure. He okay. Cause he's showing me something like this. So there's a reference there. He's also drawing on my skin. Are there two tattoos connected to him? He has a ton of tattoos, but, but I you... get tattoos and resemblance for him. Okay, got it. Because he's acknowledging tattoos for him. So even though he may have had a lot of tattoos, there might be two tattoos that are going to be connected to him. So if you're planning on getting one, then maybe one, there might be another one that's connected to him as well. Because he's acknowledging that. He also, he's pointing to himself. Um, do you know if he wasn't 100% himself when he passed or if he was under the influence? Because I kind of feel like I'm not paying attention to what I'm doing. And I'm being like, almost like, um, I'm being... Um, I'm being stupid. I'm being dumb. I'm being dumb. That's the way he's calling it. So he's just acknowledging that. He also keeps acknowledging that he was trying to prove himself to people. He was trying to be like, like, it's almost like whenever someone's racing and they're stepping on the engine and they're trying to speed, 
that's like the way he makes me feel. It's almost like I'm trying to prove something to people. So that's the way he's acknowledging that. He is blaming himself for his passing. He also says it was bad timing. Do you know if he passed around a birthday or a significant date? He passed away when our son was six months old. Okay, so he's acknowledging that. But do you know if it happened around a birthday or a significant date? It happened like uh, right around his mom's birthday. Okay, because he's acknowledging it happening in a bad timing, so he's making reference to that. He also keeps thank you. He's sorry. Did y'all talk about getting married and then y'all split? Um, when we were together, we talked about like having kids and like, you know, we were like, oh, well, if it happens, like, we'll be happy about it. And then like, out of nowhere, we just broke up and we never talked again. And okay. then so he was gone. Yeah, he's acknowledging how it ended. Um, he's apologizing to you because he says he wasn't man enough to talk to you about it and to like really tell you what was going on because he makes me feel like there were other things that were connected to that as well and that you deserved an explanation or you deserved to know why he did that so he's just apologizing for that um i have a candle lit for him right now oh cool okay um he's laughing he broke did you already have one that broke in half yeah, uh, like all, a lot of my candles. I just went to get a candle for him right now because I asked him to come to, to come to me. And a lot of my candles were broken. That was the only one that wasn't broken. Perfect. He's, he's like acknowledging that he knows that the candles were broken and that you had to find one that wasn't broken. He's just referring, affirming that. I don't know why he's bringing up elephants. I don't know if he had big ears or there's something about elephants, but he's like calling like Dumbo, you know, thinking about Dumbo. So that's what he's showing me. So that's so that's what he has big ears like perfect he's just making fun of himself so he's just acknowledging that um you're going to see him from time to time he says that sometimes he likes to it's gonna sound scary or creepy he likes to stand he stand over you while you're sleeping and watch you sleep so he says he likes to do that if you ever wake up and you feel like someone's breathing next to you or something that's him he says he doesn't mean to scare you he's just stopping in he says he don't want to mess with you but he just wants to see you again so he's just acknowledging that he also he also, thank you. He also keeps acknowledging, did he have a habit of biting on your lip or like liking to chew on your lip? Because he's like biting on your lip. So that's just acknowledging that. Sometimes you would get mad at him because he bit too hard or he would like not realize it. He's just like acknowledging that. He's fine. He says to tell his family that he's okay. He's talking about a brother. Does, does he have a brother? Um, he has, a, well, his brother, one of his brothers actually passed right after him. And, then okay. he has and he has another brother? Oh yeah, little brother. Yeah. Okay. He wants to say to the, thank you. He's, I'm asking if the other brother's with him. He says yes, but then he says, tell him that we're, we're together, we're together, we're together. Um, even though they may not have 100% gotten along, which is funny. So I don't know if the brother that passed and he wouldn't always get along, but he says to tell the brother that's still alive that, that they're together. He also says, thank you for taking, I don't know if that brother stepped in to be there more for the mom or trying to help the mom a lot more, but he's acknowledging the saying to thank him, to thank him, to thank him. So he's acknowledging that as well. He also says he still owes you money. Did you lend him $50? He never paid you back? Um, um, I think I, he, he said he was gonna pay me back for like, um, uh, gas money to get to his house one day and he just never did. Like, we just never talked again. Okay, he says he still owes you the money that he, that you loaned him. So he's just letting you know, he's gonna try to find a way to pay you back that money, okay? <laughs> All right, sweetheart, you take care of yourself, mama. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, going to the next person.